hold there! Who are you? The name's Evitz. As in Evitz Marauders. The folk you killed a few years back. Now you're going to die for what you've done. Oh. <laughs> Do you think you'll leave Kirkwall someday? Of course I will. As soon as I get myself a ship, I'm sailing wherever the sea takes me. I'll miss you. You'll write to me, won't you? Do pirates write letters? <laughs> Badly. Hook hands make for awful penmanship, kitten. Watch out for the squirrels. They can be vicious little bastards.
You there. Did my love send you? Will you take me to him? I come at your father's request. You expected someone else. Fainriel, the man of my dreams. These brutes intended to take my maidenhood. As they argued about who would go first, I fainted. Then Fainriel spoke to me in a vision and told me not to fear. When I awoke, the men had slain one another. Please take me to Fainriel. I want to thank him properly. I'm sorry, but I have no way to locate him. Hey! What did you do to my man? I can't you do your good and dead. <laughs> It seems I must wait a bit longer for my love. Oh, thank you for your aid. I will find my way back to Kirkwall. The walk will tire me, and we'll be reunited in my dreams. Fainriel, my love, I'm coming. The Knight Commander is grateful for your support, Champion. Champion, welcome. Always a pleasure. And may I say, that outfit was a wise choice. There was an incident within the gallows. A number of phylacteries were destroyed and several mages took the opportunity to escape. We've recovered most of the fugitives. However, I require your assistance in tracking down the last three. How did the phylacteries get destroyed? An insurrection. Several of my own Templars orchestrated the escape, presumably out of sympathy for the mages. They turned their backs on their duty and endangered their charges as well as the city. Thankfully, most who escaped fled to their families and offered no resistance. The last three are proving more... difficult. I will force no mage back under your yoke. Let me be very clear on this matter, then. You are an apostate, one who operates freely only because you have been a protector to this city. If I suspect that is no longer the case, then I may decide your status needs to change. Threats aren't going to work. I am not threatening you. I am asking you to justify the confidence Kirkwall has granted you. With the influence you wield in this city, Champion, it is crucial you understand just what we face. Talk to these Major's families. Investigate for yourself whether they need be recaptured. Seems like you're giving me a lot of rope. Trying to hang me with it? I'm trying to solve a difficult problem in as gentle a fashion as I dare. You do not approve of my methods, but perhaps you will change your mind when you see firsthand how dangerous these apostates are. Speak to my assistant Elsa. She can tell you whatever you need to know about the fugitives. I bid you good day, champion.
Good day, champion of Kirkwall. Knight Commander Meredith has informed me that you will be tracking down the apostates on behalf of the Templars. There are three of them. Huon, Emile, and Evelina. I want to hear about Huon. Huon is an elf. He was apprehended in the alienage ten years ago. His wife, Nisa, works for a dressmaker in Lowtown. Have the Templars spoken to her? Yes. Nisa insists she has not seen Huon since he joined the Circle. Could Huon be hiding among the other elves in the alienage? The Templars' searches uncovered nothing. The Templars have also concluded that few other elves would risk hiding him. Huon was taken many years ago. Most of the alienage's inhabitants do not even know him. Tell me what you know about Emile. The second apostate is Emile de Lancey, fifth son of the Comte de Lancey. The de Lancey's have a home in Hightown, but are often out during the day. They are generally home by evening. What have they said to the Templars? The Comte and Comtesse say they have not seen Emile since he was a child. What do you know about the de Lancey's? Comte Guillaume de Lancey is a minor noble from Orlais. He and his wife came to the Free Marches over three decades ago. Emile was born in Kirkwall and sent to the Circle at age six. What do you know about Evelina? Evelina was trained for eight years in the Circle in Ferelden. She was last seen in her former residence among the refugee community in Darktown. How did she come to be in Kirkwall? Evelina claims to have fled the Blight, not the Circle. She presented herself to the First Enchanter on her arrival, and asked to take her place here. Our files indicate she petitioned Meredith for financial support of numerous other pre-adolescent Blight survivors. Did the Templars run into her in Darktown? Yes, they tracked her there, but she killed several pursuers. The Templars believe she is the most dangerous apostate. I have all the information I require for now. Good luck on your search, Champion of Kirkwall. We should move on.
can't believe you're still not taking sides. I told you, I only like to be on top. I mean against the Templars. You like freedom, right? You hate slavery. Why wouldn't you side with the mages? Maybe I just don't like you.